Hello guys, welcome to episode 2 of Chronicles Season 2. Here with Jux, and we're going to start this episode with a very quick time lapse. We are going to go the forest, the forest behind me, and when we come back, it should all be gone. So, uh, we'll take a quick string shot now, and here we go. Let's go. So guys, I was just about to put in the clip because I'm currently editing this video you're watching right now. I was just about to import the clip of me collecting my permits at the permit machine. But turns out I don't actually have that clip. So I'm just going to show you my permits here. So I got all the dyes and flowers, jungle dark oak logs, mangrove and cherry logs, mid-tier books which includes let me check here so mid-tier books includes loyalty projectile protection impaling fire protection blast protection smite sweeping edge thorns and power that's good then we have all the horns glow like a tinted glass gray terracotta blue terracotta rooted dirt glass not stained magma all abatist orange glass glowstone End crystal and light grey glass. Now beware, these are not my original permits. I did do some trading um, to get these permits. But most of them are still the same. Now, I'm going to go mining. And hopefully get some good stuff. Let's go. Just went mine there, but got some diamonds. First bit of diamonds, I guess. More diamonds. More diamonds again. More diamonds again. More diamonds. More diamonds. More diamonds. But we're just getting so lucky with diamonds today. 18 diamonds. Me and my shandy are about to go to the end. See already went. Alright. To kill the ender dragon and get her. Lighters and stuff like that. We've lit up the portal here. Let's. Oh, yeah, we have to get a screenshot first. Okay. The term of game volume dead, so this is gonna be like a soil kind of end rate. They turn my volume down. So, basically, me and Rashandi, I'm just going to pop into a time lapse here. We're going to go get elytras and everything like that. Let's go. Okay, so guys, here's a quick summary to the clip you just watched where I said I was going to time lapse me going to the end. I, when we, after we killed the dragon, we went in. I got maybe 100 blocks without finding and then city and then died. That's quick summary, that's the reason there is no clip of me going in for time lapse. Sorry guys, I just want to apologise for the lack of quality on the past few videos. Basically, um, I only...
only forgot I had to fix my OBS recently. Um, because I had it on like really, really low quality. Now I have it on max quality, so this should be better, I think. Yep. But I would just appreciate the machine jocks built. I will put a, I'll make a schematic for it and put a link to it down in the description. And yeah, he we he spent I think four and uh, maybe five, six days and about three hours each day trying to get that machine working. That's eighteen hours in total. Like and then we were designing it in another world. Yeah, so it just took us ages. Also, I have kind of fixed up the area over here. It was, it was looking a bit messy, so I just kind of fixed it all up. And it is only me online. There was paper and shandy and all. They were all on a few minutes ago. But they're gone off now for a bit. So it is just me online. Lonely. Oh. And guys, I can't, I don't know if I got this on recording or not, but basically I did a deal with Shandy and I traded off one of my permits for, what one, oh yeah, I got rid of all the food and I got another wood one, mangrove and cherry logs. So I'm going to do a bit of gathering of that, but I also want to gather a bit of glass and because we do have a lot of glass permits that are well stuff that involves glass we have the light grey glass orange glass and then we also have regular glass and tinted glass so yeah I think we might go on a little bit of a desert hunt and get so, get some glass. Oh. oh, I'm not alone here. Oh, well, just, don't, just don't tell paper. I don't really know why I'm not allowed in here. I don't do anything. I just need some food, man. <laughs> just give me some food. Does he have any emeralds? Oh god, that's a lot of iron mm -hmm. doors. Okay. So you did see in the last clip that we went, me and Shandy went to the end. But then I died. But I did manage to go and get my stuff back. Just, I kind of just kind of stopped recording. But yeah, I did manage to go get my stuff back. Which was quite important because I had, and this is hidden. Oh, there, why is it in there that is not small? I had the dragon egg. I did also get dragon head when, when I killed the dragon. That might be a mod we actually have installed. I don't even know half the data packs I installed on this. But yeah, we did get some diamonds, which got us all this armor. But then also paper ball. He wanted, because he was basically, we were renting this area out to him over here where he has his base. I'll just show you quickly. We were renting this area out over here to him. And it was like four diamonds per IRL week. Well, he just bought it for four diamond blocks. But let me know, guys, if you think that's enough. I think that I think we should have went a bit higher. Because I don't think we charged him enough for literally, like, this whole area. Why is there a tunnel going to under my villagers? I do not like that.
Well, they just say he actually got his villagers over there. Not go yet. So I don't think we charge him enough for this area here. No, I have just kind of cleaned up our area over here. We're gonna get rid of all this now and fix the hole there, and then we're gonna go on some permit grinding to gather some materials for our permits. Oh, I not have it. I have wool down here. I'm gonna make a bed because I don't know where our bed went. We do also have the, all the go or the go horns. Was it? I think. I think we have that permit. So yeah, I did get a go horn. Okay, so I'm going to go find a quick desert in the form of a time lapse and then I'm going to go into another time lapse where we are going to get, we're going to get all the sand and then smelt the sand. So I'm going to go with my horse and yeah, let's go. Okay, so now we've made it here. Now we have to mine all the sand. Let's go mine some sand. So guys, I've filled my inventory up with all the, all the sand I can. My shovel just broke as well. Guys, our, so basically the glass shop, we got it all smelted I did. And I've opened the shop over here. One diamond for two stacks. I think that's pretty good. We do also have to make this, hold on, slash. Wrong command. Oh, I don't actually have that. Do not. I don't have that data pack installed on this actually. I'll have to basically I'll have to install that. It's the invisible item frame data pack. Well, yeah, so I set up the shop here. And paper is actually he's wondering, will you deliver? Yep. And we, yeah, we do deliver. We will deliver for an extra iron. But yeah, hopefully we make some sales. Now that we do actually need to get a bit more glass because that's definitely not enough. We need to have the whole shop stocked, and we also have two other glass permits. I think. I think it's two other ones. But, yeah. Alright, so guys, um, Paper does want some, he wants 10 stacks of glass, which would be 5 diamonds, but it's also paying us a little extra for the delivery. So we will almost be able to stock then. But, yeah, let's go grab uh, the glass. So guys, I have just gotten a bunch of stock for the glass shop. And yes, I have gotten rid of my horse. But we also went and got some dark oak saplings, because we have the permit for that. Cherry logs, we have the permit for that. And I don't know if it's grown yet. Yeah, jungle log. We do also have the mangrove tree as well. So we have everything we need to sell, all the wood types. 
So, yeah, I'm going to head over to Shopping District and stock up the glass shop. And, yeah, we did make some sales yesterday. Got five diamonds. But I did just realise that you can actually... You can actually make... You can actually get glass from villagers. For some reason, I didn't know that. I'm not sure if it's, it might just be glass panes. I'm not sure though. I think I might lower the price of this though to, or higher the price of this one diamond a stack. Because glass is quite hard to get. Because it's like you have to get all the coal or whatever you're going to use to smelt it with. It takes eight coal to stack wood to smelt one glass. So we might eventually put it back to the price it's currently at. But yeah. Yeah, we're not gonna do deliveries, we're gonna only do you go to chop and buy it. Okay, one diamond. Who's one diamond? We're gonna go one diamond. One stack. And we have, I think we have 25 stacks here. Yeah, we do. So, if we split 25. It would be four stacks in each, I think. No, it might actually be six stacks in each. Yep, sorry, it would be six stacks in each. Six. 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 And we'll just put an extra stack in here at the front. Now, that's all stocked up. And I'll just message, put in a message saying that the glass stop is stocked up okay so I've just put a message in oh I didn't know donkeys can go underwater without kicking me off alright now we are actually going to head 4,000 blocks away to get some terracotta because we do have the terracotta permits well some of them um, so we're gonna head and go get some terracotta and when I come back we will turn it all into the we will gather all the dyes and then yeah so I will see you when we have all the ter wait go again I'll see you when we have all our terracotta ready. L let's go get some terracotta. Right here, you're probably waiting for me to cut to a clip of me standing right here with a bunch of terracotta. But, um, I kind of, I did go get terracotta, but for some reason... My little brain didn't think to record any of it. So, here is Terracotta. I got a lot more. I can't remember where I put it though. But, yeah, I got a lot more. But, that's going to be it for Chronicles Season 2, Episode 2. Hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.